How's it going everyone? My name is Nori Plays. Welcome once again to the channel and welcome to Incredibox. Uh, we are back at it again. This time with another special one because Sliced Times, Sliced Limes, sorry, has given me a kind of unreleased version of Voltage that we can check out. And because it's unreleased, he doesn't obviously want to share it with the rest of you yet. So I won't be able to again provide a link until he gives me the go ahead to do that so this is what it looks like apparently everything has been changed apart from the last animation and design and things like that uh, i guess you guys will tell me down below in the comments but okay here's the main splash screen purple theme i love it purple and white it's a, a little bit of pink maybe perhaps in some places like right here uh very interesting very awesome but before i press this button I'm going to tell you guys once again that we are so close to 10k. If, you're, if you've been watching any of my videos and you are a fan of the channel, please make sure to subscribe. It would help me out a lot. And check the link in the description because we have a Discord server that you can check out. And I stream every Saturday at 1pm BST. You can convert that over to your time zone. Let's go. Voltage. Look at that. Very clean aesthetic. Purple, black, black, purple. Kind of inverted i like it i like it a lot there's no bonus so once again we'll go through the beats the effects the melodies and the voices and then just make a mix out of that let's not waste any more time once again i just want to get right in and get down and dirty because i've been waiting for this to come out for quite some time now i don't want to cover it before this kind of update but here we are now all right the beats stop waffling let's go Straight away, you can hear it's got kind of like a a nice echo to the beat. And a very heavy electrical sound. The polo design is also very clean, very clean. I love the whole bomb aesthetic. The timer looks really good. The font looks really good. The only thing maybe is that little explosion right there. That doesn't look very good. But it sounds good. It sounds good. The first two already sound good. I can't really guess the theme quite yet. So we're going to have to just keep going. I love uh, how that this kind of sounds offbeat because then if we combine it with beat one or two, it's going to feel a bit more complete and a bit more full, which I like. I like the sound of that. Again, the design, spot on. Love the sound. A bassy beat. In a way, I guess that does make sense if you think about it. It's got a bit of like hi-hats in there as well, which is fine. A bit of open hi-hats. You know what? That's, that sounds good, man. That sounds good. This is a cool one as well, but this kind of feels like an effect. Do you know what I mean? The design is also really quirky. <laughs> Very cool, man. Very cool. Beats, kind of a bit quirky. But I think they're good. I think they're good. I like them. I haven't found really anything wrong with the sounds. Obviously, some of them, like this one, for example, sounded like an effect because of that bass sound. But then it kind of also had the beat with the whole hi-hat thing alongside it, so I guess that's fine. This also kind of sounded like an effect because of that one shot that lasts three quarters of the loop. Yeah, see, it lasts a long time, so it feels more like an effect, I'd say. But the other four makes sense to me. All right. 
Effects, let's go. I pray that this is a base. God damn. God damn, I pray that this is a base. Hello? I'm addicted to the base. I'm addicted to the base. Okay, that that sounded funny. I can't lie, that sounded pretty funny. The way that Kyle at the end, I don't know. It's gonna make it the usage of it is gonna be very strict because I'll have to remove it right before that sound cuts off, so that I can fully utilize that polo. Because otherwise, if I keep it for more than two loops, it's gonna sound really weird. And I better place this well. <laughs> Hit me up with the robotic sounds, man. I love this stuff. Yeah, that's a sick polo right there. That is a sick polo. I, I like this one. Oh my god. So the bass is on effect free, essentially. The first one is like a vocal, then this second one is a uh, electric, electric sounding. Okay, interesting. Usually this would be here, but it's kind of cool that it's not. It's the polo from the main splash screen. And the uh, icon. And the reverse. A reverse sound of that. I don't know what to say about that one. That one's unique. I c these are effects, though. These are effects by a long shot. So it makes sense that they're like that. All right, let's keep going. Final effect, let's hear it. Again, with the cutoff, I don't know how I feel about the whole, s whole sound cutting off like that. Also, what is that? Is that like smoke? Pixelated smoke? I did like the way this started with this. But then it just cuts off really suddenly. Maybe it will make sense once I start putting stuff together. Okay, so uh, let me give you the ratings for half of the stuff now. Because we covered half of it. So the beats are, to me, an 8. An 8. They're pretty quirky, but probably usable. Effects. Uh, I don't like how two of those effects cut out very suddenly. So effects, I will give like a 7.5. That doesn't mean it's bad. That doesn't mean it's bad by a long shot. To me, something like Soul Gem was a lot more unpolished when that came out, when I covered that on the channel. And that would have been like a 4 or 5, okay? Just so that you know. I might have rated it differently in that video at the time. But now that I think about it, it was very unpolished. And anything over a 6 or a 5 is a good mod still. Okay, melodies, let's go. That actually sounds really good. I'm a fan of this melody already. Melodies are gonna cook, I can feel it. That sounds really good. Again, the polar design. Ooh, sweet reverb. But yeah, the I don't know why 
so many modders recently are so obsessed with like traffic lights looking polos. This is fine, but the sound was really decent. I, I enjoyed I enjoyed the melodies so far. It's like a vocal melody. It's kind of funny, but I like it. I like it nonetheless. The design again, very cool as well with the goggles and the little a pink hair accents. I'm a fan. <laughs> This is a cool polo as well, again. It's very unique sounding. I love the little purple glass dome that's over the top. It sounds very clean. Final melody. I mean, all I've enjoyed the most so far. I like how seamless that is, actually. I'm starting to understand the genre a bit more as well, now that I've heard most of the sounds um, in this mod. So, it's kind of like a space theme. Well, I, I, I should be able to tell by the polos already, right? Everything screams space theme about this. It's like sci-fi. But... That piano was really well made, like, it helped me picture the theme really well. I think that is the best polo from this mod so far, actually. My favorite by far. The piano is really well made. Finally, we got to the voices. Will they cook? Will they be cringe? Let's find out. I've been looking for the right thing. So baby, tell me where you're hiding. Okay, there's a bit of issues with this polo. I don't think this was intentional. But that's fine. Okay, so this polo wasn't bad as well, the voices, but the ending sounded a bit weird to me. Like, it should go something like this instead. Oh, It goes up once and then down to the bottom instead of up and up again. Because the moment it went up again, it sounded pretty weird and distorted in my opinion I'll only love you when the money right that was a sick polo that, that animation with a mask got taken off so it took me by surprise. That was some really good animation right there. And the sound as well took me by surprise as well. Changed up completely like the mood. Which makes sense with the whole mask as well. Really cool polo. Really cool polo. Really cool design. So these are like Malismatics, I think they're called. They're pretty good actually. 
They're not bad. And the emo looking guy. You know what? Cool. That's cool stuff right there. Some of the polos looked a bit blurry to me. I don't know what that's about. Um, I think I am on HQ mode and stuff like that. So it should sound good, honestly. But I'm very interested to see what is going to happen when we start putting these together. Because I don't know what I'm going to do for the mix. I'm going to be honest. I don't know what polo I want to really start with. Probably the piano. Again, my favorite polo. Probably start with that. And then kind of build up, then build down, then kind of end it on the same polo as well. Um, just a very simple building block formula that I've kind of made for my mixes. Yeah, overall my thoughts for at least when it comes to each of the polos as a whole package, just by themselves, if you were just to play them one by one, I know that's not how you do it, but I would give it an 8.5. 8.5. It's not quite a 9 there for me because i don't know i don't really i've kind of died out with the theme of sci-fi for quite a while unless it's like something epical epic sci-fi music something like stardust was right um which sliced limes compared it to so he also apologized if it's not up to par with it but i feel like it doesn't really compete with it because it's just it's just in a different genre by itself. It's not as epical, but it's more like uh, I'm trying to I'm trying to put a finger on it. Like it's dystopian, right? It's I, I want to say it's dystopian. So yeah, before I get into this mix, because I've had enough yapping for now. Again, friendly reminder: subscribe. We're on the road to 10k. We're a hundred subs away, man. Let's make that happen. When we hit 10k, I'll do a Q&A and all that good stuff. 90% of you are not subscribed. Usually, that number is way lower when it comes to YouTube. Like, 50%, 60%, man. So, a lot of you are watching but are not so hitting that button. I'm gonna need you to hit that for the, to show your support. Again, Discord server down below and I stream every Saturday. Apart from that, I'll see all of you after I've done something with the mix. See you later.
Okay. That mix went on for longer than I'd wanted to, but it was kind of a vibe. I don't know what to feel about it, honestly. I don't know what to feel about it. I think my opinion on the mod still stands. It's an 8.5, maybe an 8 if I'm feeling really mean, though. The 8.5, I feel like, is a good, good space as to where I'd put this mod. As to where I'd put this mod, yeah. There were a few issues with it, again, namely the chorus. Well, the chorus, the choir, I guess I'd call it instead. And a few other ones that I wouldn't want to name. Again, the ones that I cut off, notably, they were fine up to a point. Same with the... This guy I feel kind of out of place a little bit as well. Um, it's just kind of like, there's too many different instruments, I think, within this mod that are kind of out of the theme, kinda. I don't know, it, it's a very weird mod, isn't it? At least to me anyway. So yeah, I'm gonna leave it at that, 8.5. Again, I can't leave the link down below in the description as to respect what Slice Limes is saying. So, yeah, that would be the Voltage unfinished update because, again, Slice Limes need a break from it, so he kind of just sent it to me anyway before it was even finished as a way to say that, like, hey, I'm going to take a break, but you can try it anyway kind of thing. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed, make sure you smash the like button. Comment down below with your thoughts about this kind of unfinished, unreleased version. Uh, did you enjoy it? Did you enjoy my mix of it? Did you enjoy the polos? What issues would you have, for example, if you tried this, if you had the opportunity to try it? And yeah, again, subscribe if you are new, and I will see all of you amazing people in the next video. Peace out.